Hello YouTube, this is Josh from the Pantech Brothers, and this is the Tech News at Noon. So today, Samsung announced that it will be releasing a software update to the Galaxy Note 7 that will essentially brick it when it comes to being able to charge. This is in an effort, obviously, to try to stem any possible future incidents with the devices catching fire or exploding which I think is a pretty good idea if it's that big of an issue with those devices since they issued a worldwide recall of the device that it would need to keep any future uh, issues that could may arise from people who haven't returned or exchanged their Note 7s from catching fire. Um, Verizon has come out and basically stated that they will refuse to push out this update and they don't feel like it's good for their users to not be able to use their mobile devices to communicate with friends and family during the holiday season as well as possible first responders or medical professionals during you know times of an emergency so that's their choice but that's their sta official stance as of now but i don't think it's a bad idea for samsung if those devices pose that great of a risk um, that they would uh, push out this type of update would be a necessity, I guess, in their eyes. Next up, uh, the much anticipated first official Nintendo game will release next week, on December 15th, on Apple iOS, Super Mario Run. And it has caught the attention of people because they reached out to Shigeru Miyamoto and found out that the app will require a constant internet connection. And so it's really just one of those like, you know, temple run style games where you just move a character back and forth up and down on an endless level. And so, you know, people are kind of a little disappointed that it requires an internet connection to play, you know, especially those people on long trips that just want something to, you know, relax and take their mind off of what they're what they're doing and just have something to play. And especially in a plane where you don't necessarily have internet connection. It's a real disappointment. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoy Tech News at Noon. And we will be back next week with a whole new batch of tech news.